So before making the struvite reactor, we will see what exactly it is and how it works. So basically the struvite reactor has two chambers. One of them is to stir the mixture which is urine and magnesium and the another one is to collect the mixture and separate the water from it so strovite can be used as a fertilizer it contains diammonium phosphate and having these given advantages and here's the application so at first I will make a mixing chamber for that I have taken this 2 liter aluminium can I will mark where we have to cut Remove the sharp edges. These plastic bottles will hold our mixing chamber. This way, I will cut the neck so that it fits well. To bend the edges, I am hitting it on the iron. Then after we need the support for that I have taken my tripod. I will remove the unnecessary things. Now I will drill a hole on the cap of mixing chamber. This plastic bottle will hold the cap over the chamber. I am melting the glue to stick the cap on the plastic bottle. Similarly, I will make a hole in this plastic cap.
This bearing will hold our stator and will allow to rotate freely. Screws will hold the arm seal stronger. The valve is to bring down the mixture to the dehydration chamber. Once it's mixed well, gluing it well to avoid the leakage. Now I will make a stirrer. This plastic ring will hold this stirrer at its place. And this is the main part of the stirrer. It will row the mixture evenly. For the dehydration chamber, I have used a small bottle. This holes will allow the water draining out and this way we will get a solid fertilizer. For filtration, I have used a PP filter cloth of 0.5 micron. After all, now it's ready to use. Okay, hope you like this video and sure to subscribe. See you in the next video.